The present connection of Frank Fritz, star of American Pickers, with Mike Wolf, his former co-star and closest friend, has come to light after their ugly public dispute. From 2010 until the beloved show's last episode in March 2020, Mike, 59, and Frank, 59, were regulars on American Pickers. After a surprising fight that lasted years, the lifelong friends recently reconnected over Memorial Day weekend. Today, the U.S. Sun can disclose the condition of their relationship exclusively. A person familiar with Frank's situation told the U.S. Sun, everything between them is fine. Frank is still on the road to recovery after a stroke he had in July 2022. They've been friends for 40 years. Together, they've been through high school and all this. Truly, they are the best of friends. According to the source, Mike has paid Frank a handful of times visits since the stroke, and they have also been in touch by call and text today. The insider said that Frank is even closer to Mike's brother Robbie than Mike is to Frank even though Frank has replaced the beloved character on the program. Frank needs to do what he has to do now that he had a stroke, the friend added. Meanwhile, the show, Robbie and Mike do what's necessary. In spite of everything, they're still simply friends, and their talk is the same as before. That is the topic of discussion, since those men are very obsessed with locating and choosing things. Frank made his last appearance on American Pickers in an episode airing in March of 2020. After undergoing back surgery which left him with 185 stitches and two rods in his spine, he stepped away from the program to recuperate. Frank went to an Iowa treatment for alcoholism for 77 days and dropped 65 pounds while he was away from the show. The conflicts between Frank and co-star Mike was discussed in Frank's interview with the U.S. Sun in 2021. I haven't spoken to Mike in two years, Frank said. He should have called to see how I was doing after discovering my back was in a bad spot. That's the way things are. He is getting a tenfold advantage in the show. No amount of bending over would allow me to demonstrate how much. It's acceptable. Imagine Aerosmith with Steven Tyler as the lead singer. I finally found my place on the program now I'm in second place, behind him. Perhaps he does have an issue, but it doesn't bother me. It was also revealed that he believed Mike was trying to replace him with his brother Robbie. I am perplexed by his behavior towards me. As he posted a picture of the buddies on Instagram in July 2021, Mike disclosed Frank's termination soon after the interview. For as long as my memory serves me, Frank has been there, supporting me like a brother. Like every other part of life, the path that Frank, Danny, and I set out on in 2009 has been filled with ubis and downs, advantages and disadvantages, but above all else, it has been the most fulfilling. Your unwavering support has served as a continual reminder of the show's enduring message, that we are all connected by our shared experiences, connections, and experiences. We're here to make sure that the past and each other are taken care of. Mike came to a conclusion. I wish Frank the best of luck and happiness on his next chapter, and I know that we will all miss him. After Frank had a stroke in July 2022, he was promptly put under guardianship and conservatorship. The Quad City Times was informed by a friend that Frank and Mike reconciled after a heartfelt reunion that took place over Memorial Day weekend. This was absolutely not a feud between Frank and Mike, the source claimed. Their enmity was unfounded. In order to really value one another, they need space apart. After 11 seasons of working 10 hours a day, 7 days a week on the reality program, the buddy said that their connection grew strained. According to the newspaper's source, the guys were overcome with emotion at the long-awaited reunion. Both were crying, the buddy said. It was one of their first major performances, and Mike brought up how anxious they were about it. His longtime co-star Frank was informed by Mike, Nobody can replace you.